Okay, Francophone, thanks for the super chat. He says, how did your people react to your conversions? Yeah, so talk, talk to us a little bit about your family uh, and your friends. How do they react? Uh, let Maybe just go one at a time, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> sure. So to give you... So- to give you an idea, there was a scale that we made uh, of how people would react to when we told them we were becoming Catholic. One was the indifferentist, they didn't care. And then 10 was Martin Luther. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and so, you know, honestly, I was very nervous telling my parents, um, I, you know, because I didn't know how they react. I knew that my parents definitely didn't necessarily like the church, but I had definitely had comments over the years that were very much anti Catholic. And so, when I phoned my parents, they were actually in Rome of all places. And uh, when I told them, uh, they very much so understood my reasonings, my, mainly the intellectual reasonings. Uh, they weren't necessarily thrilled or happy, um, but they chose to, tr- they, they basically said, you know, at the end of the day, as long as you're serving Christ, you know, that's good for us. And, I, and since then, it's been very good because um, they've definitely warmed up to me um, trying to present my faith to them, um, even to the point of coming to, to Mass with me, which has been a, a huge blessing. And so overall, I've been very, very uh, blessed and graced to have a great reaction. Sean or Jack, you want to respond? Uh, yeah, whenever um, my parents found out, they were not the, they were probably the same boat as, as, as Nick. They were worried that um, I had jumped the gun. It was uh, like a very, like, quick thing they like presented with me a bunch of straw men um but as uh as we like begin to build up like dialogue and stuff uh they've they've realized it's more it it, there's more grounds uh to to my conversion than just uh oh all my friends were doing it (laughs) and uh they also are um not the most thrilled but the same boat as, as as nick they're like as long as they're serving God. Jack? Sure. Uh, between my, my family, there were two polar opposite reactions. So my mother and my sister could not have been more excited for me just to be happy about something. Um, <laughs> so they were infinitely supportive of me, my mother and my sister. They, uh, they always have seemed to have my back in any situation. It doesn't really seem what the context is. In total opposition to that, uh, my dad could not accept it. Um, this was something that he, what he saw as a fundamental separation uh, from us that inhibited us to have a relationship. Um, and so I think he still struggles with seeing it to that to that direction. It's hard. I very much so see two people in my dad on one hand, um, his bringing up of having such animosity um, and hatred towards the Catholic church. And on the other hand, the fact that, you know, he's my father and he loves me. And I know that he loves me um, despite his hatred for what I believe and the church that I'm a part of. So when I called him, he was, he was very, very upset uh, that I had made the decision to become Catholic. Um, I think it was out of the blue for him, uh, despite our, our, us having uh, constant debates about it. It was something that came up every single time We talked on the phone, the fact that I was, you know, reading about Catholicism and the history of Catholicism. And um, that was that was problematic. That was problematic for him. Um, However, yeah, he had initially a very poor reaction. Um, Months later, he was more so able to accept the fact that we are different. uh, But he very much so would explain my conversion as uh, the manifested problem from what he saw his like his failures as a father in my life and so um yeah it's a it's a very tough thing that he's he's uh he's dealing with and and uh, it's it's only gotten worse since my uh recent application to seminary so uh, (laughs) we didn't even touch upon that yet yeah yeah but uh uh, god god bless him you know i mean for those who are watching who might be unsympathetic you know to how your dad reacted you just have to ask 
you know, I just asked myself the question, like imagine if my son called up one day and said he was becoming a Mormon, you know, like, would I be like, that's great, son. No, like if I thought Mormonism was false, you better believe I'd be upset about that and I'd do whatever I could to help him see the light. And that's that's a place your dad's in. And, you know, the fact he's, he's, he's hurt by this because he loves you, because he cares about you. Like if... If some other random Protestant becomes Catholic, he might shrug his shoulders, but but not care, of course, you know. Exactly. Thank you for watching this clip. You can click here to watch the full episode. And I want to say a big thanks to our sponsors and to our amazing patrons for making all of this possible. Please do us a favor before you go, click that subscribe button and then the bell. And that way YouTube will be forced to let you know every time we put out a new episode.